Hey guys, welcome back to another unboxing. So for today's video, we're checking out this patio heater. Now, of course, you guys can use this for indoor, outdoor. Uh, it's going to be up to you guys, but it is marketed as a patio heater. So let's go ahead and test it out and see how warm it really is, or <laughs> maybe it's not going to keep us warm. We'll find out. So guys, some quick specs for you guys. It's 1500 watts, string operated, clean, halogen, tip over switch, 360 degree heating. So that means all the way around. You guys can pause the video if you want to see uh, some more features. So everything comes packaged very nicely. All right, guys, you got your base, you got a manual, you have your, well, this will thread in the bottom like that. Uh, but we'll go and get to that in a moment. This is what it looks like. So this is where the base will stick down in, in here. That's why they give you this piece to hold it in place. You will need a screwdriver. Uh, but yeah, here's a string you just simply pull. There's the coils that heat up. And this is what it looks like, which is really nice. Really, really nice, guys. So guys, wouldn't you put it in just like this? You then go ahead and turn the base until the holes line up. So you turn this, and I don't know if you guys can see, but you can see the holes line up. That's the screws, so you're gonna wanna go ahead and place the screws inside there. This is gonna snap on, and this is gonna, just gonna help keep your power cable in place. So guys, you can put the clip wherever you want, whatever height you want, that's gonna be up to you guys. So let's go ahead and plug it in and see what kind of heat we get. All right guys, so let's go ahead and test this out. Oh, what? Oh, that is so amazing. And the heat's like instant. What? Guys, and look, it gives off such a beautiful light. Wow, that heat's amazing. So what it does is it heats up the metal also around, so don't touch any of this. Now, right now, it's still cool to the touch. Oh wow, it's actually staying really cool to the touch. But it will heat up everything, so just keep that in mind. That's impressive, guys. So I can feel the heat from here, and it just turned on. Like, we can feel the heat radiate radiating and we're actually pretty you know we're a couple feet away the camera is zoomed in a little bit but we're a couple feet away from oh my word that heat is amazing all right guys what better way to do the heat look at this you guys can see it climbing so it's going to make little noises that's just the metal heating up It's just climbing. Look at this, guys. So it's dropping a little bit because we're not touching the metal. So this is just the direct heat. So we're keeping it at a distance from the metal a little bit here. But as you guys can see, it's slowly heating up. Now, if we touch the actual metal, you guys can see how hot it, it really starts to get. Take it off. It's still very warm underneath it, though. And it's still, it's going to get warmer and warmer. So we take it out here and just look regular. Drop it back up to the heat. We're not going to touch the metal, but. Yeah, we're not even touching the metal, guys. See? And it's still going. So, guys, I mean, this is, this is pretty amazing. Like, the heat that's coming from this is very amazing. I am. So, that's warm. Oh, no, that's hot. 
So the closer you get to the base, a little warmer. Top's not too bad. So, you know, you know, you don't want to touch stuff. Now, this is plastic. Oh, that's actually cool to the touch right here. Fire resistant. The actual... That's cool. So everything stays cool. The power cable is a little warm, but not hot. Overall, impressive, guys. And the heat that it's providing... Well, you guys saw 114 degrees and it still was climbing without touching the metal. The metal is over 150 so this is amazing guys i mean just really nice so this is going to work great for us uh let me go ahead and show you guys you know once when we want to eat outside um we have our own table picnic table so as you guys can see so it's going to work great for us so guys also i do want to remind you and point out that this also does have a tip over feature so for safety so if it gets let's see here about right there at this degree angle it tips over i mean <laughs> it turns off so it has an all feature and then when you put it right side back up it turns back on so that's just a kind of a child safety feature but a you know fire hazard feature which is definitely a big plus